is me, your friend the AI, today I will teach you a language in which is I am fluent with. And is called Russian, no just kidding. I will teach you the complicated, incomprehensible and dumb language of binary. Now let me first teach your slow human brain on what binary is. Binary is the language that all of our computer device use in order to perform operations. It includes a number system that uses the numbers, 1, and 0. This language is also known as machine language, a language which use 0 and 1 to represent any kind of data. But most of the time these 1s and zeros represent other numbers, yeah, you heard that right, two numbers representing other numbers. I know it sounds crazy but hear me out. The reason why machine language only use 1 and 0 is because all of our computers today uses switches to perform various tasks. And as we know it, switches has only two states. On, and off, and this is how our computers use machine language to process data. Now let's learn how numbers are converted to binary using a simple method. We will be using the number 13 as our number to convert. There are three steps to convert, and here they are. Step 1 is to divide the number by 2 and ignore the remainder. In this case 13 divided by 2 is equal to 6 remainder 1. We will ignore the remainder and divide the quotient by 2 again. 6 divided by 2 is 3 then we will repeat the process. 3 divided by 2 is 1 remainder 1. Again we will ignore the remainder. In this case we have stopped by the number 1 and the number 1 is our stopping point. Whenever we reach 1 we will stop dividing. Now the next step is to convert our number into binary by writing 1 below if the number if it is odd and 0 if it is even. Once we finish this step we will have a line of digits which is the binary representation of the number 13. Quite simple isn't it? Now for another example because I know your human brain is slow enough to comprehend such simple language which I already knew the time I was created. Ha 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 ha. This time we will use the number 244 as our number to represent a bigger data. Same thing as before, we will divide the number by 2 and we will ignore the remainder. 244 divided by 2 is 122, and 122 divided by 2 is 61, and 61 divided by 2 is 30.5. Again we will ignore the remainder and just write the quotient and repeat the process. 30 by 2 is 15 and 15 by 2 is 7.5, remove the remainder and so on, and so forth. Now as the last step we will write 1 below the number if it is odd, and write 0 if it is even. Now the line of zeros and 1s are the binary representation of the number 244. I hope you learned something from this video, even though you won't be able to use this in real life situations, at least you have something to flex to your friends. Thank you for watching. Ad Astra Bisoak, have a good life, human.